Hello everyone, I'm Mr. Mocha Lover and thank you for joining me here. So, today, let's continue playing as the Chichen Itza, as well as begin to invade Nueva Atzlan. Now, Nueva Atzlan, they haven't lost really much of anything so far. Actually, they've lost nothing. They've only taken a little bit of land from me, which is a big no-no. And they have a ton of division, so trying to attack them will prove to be a little difficult. But, we can still do it. Anyways, right now, at the end of last episode, I was attempting to make an encirclement here, but it's not exactly going as planned, so give our guys a little bit of time. Oh, I'm also taking out this settlement here. and We have another settlement that needs your help, hero. Anyways, I forget what the protagonist name of Fallout 4 is, but whatever. Um, You know what? You guys can just all march right into here. Ooh, to pill. We got some complicated circuitry. Very nice. Um, since we are civilized, I'm thinking, you know what, it might be a good time to maybe attempt to get some planes. I think that would be a jolly good thing to do. You can go ahead and help out down here as well. Actually, yeah, that's not bad. We could cut these guys off, perhaps. Uh, for right now, there's too many guys right here. Ooh, that is not good right there. Uh, give me, give me all the spec ops. Just take, attack the capital for now. Give them a little extra push. Let you guys do that. I don't care if these guys move around, because that division will die. Fairly soon, so no worries about that. Uh, do that, yep. Yeah. Encircle that division. Nice, we got a couple extra dockyards, not bad. We got a schooner and we have a Trierame. Um, I guess do another schooner for now and deploy Cancun Ka. Thank you very much. And right now we have counting down to the day of Ka'an. 15 days, not worried about it since it's abundant, anyways. Very nice. Have a little bit of water. I have some coffee here with me. Oh, okay, so they just capitulated by themselves. That's very interesting. So, before I actually annex them, I do want to let you know that someone recommended that I play as Costa Cafinada. Cafinada. Um, that's interesting. I might consider it, but the next episode, or the next campaign, most likely will not be in Old World Blues because it's, I played a ton of Old World Blues. Which isn't bad at all, but it's just I played so much of Old World Blues lately that... Maybe we give it at least one break. Give it a little bit of a break. Alright, so cool. You guys are down here. You guys come over here. And I need you to, like, break through there as fast as possible. You guys are over here. And I want you guys to do that, which will be great. You should be able to hold the entire line that way. Um, do we have anyone else? Yes, we have the Spec Ops, which will be very important. Because I will try to navally invade this tile, cut these divisions off. So, oh, we also have... These 12 divisions up here, very nice. So you guys, you guys come up here and invade there. Um, yeah, do that and invade, very nice, very nice. And then, two, three, four, five. So we're going to launch five divisions right there. If we can take that place, great. If we can't, no real loss. Uh, we have a naval port right here, which is actually pretty good. Oh, we have... Something right there as well. I didn't catch that. Hmm, what shall we do? We could just navally invade that there. I don't really care. Hmm. Invade here. Five divisions will be good enough just because you only have so much combat with you can throw at one thing at a time. Go ahead and do that. Invade that area because why not? It doesn't really... Oh, actually we can't do that because we have no access to that. So that was actually a waste. Dang it. Uh, if anything, just go ahead for you five. Just come down here and do that. I'm not going to give them an arrow to like attack because I only want to attack in the north using our naval invasion support up here. So, uh, ships, where are my shippies? You are up here. Do this. Also add you to here. Damn, I took that off. Why not? There's really no point for you to do that. Go ahead and reorganize. They're going to take a little piece of the land. That's totally fine. Frequency analysis. Very nice. Get some more encryption. Very good. Uh, but I guess for now, you guys can probably just move straight on in. Since they're not really doing very much. Which is good for us. Oh, and they actually landed there. Dang it. Or they came down there. Give me half of you guys. Come down here and... Oh, they're still moving. They're moving everyone that way. Interesting. Interesting. Maybe not. Maybe I lied. Maybe I didn't know what the truth was. And that's okay. Actually, you know what? For, for this... Everyone come over here and do that. And then split you guys in half. Sit you right next to each other. Do that. Do that. Do the offensive line. Thank you very much. Well, at least we capitulated, or even annexed, 
Oxaca, no, the Costa Caffeine people. So we, we, we will have to break through here. Ooh. Uh, don't worry about attacking for now. Kind of leave that alone. Let them wail, rail themselves against us right now. Actually, we have a naval port right here. We could naval invade this area. That's not a bad idea, actually. I could do that. Not bad. Not bad, Mr. Mocha Lover. Not bad. Where are you guys at? You're currently... You're ready to go, actually. And then you five are also down here. Good. Mm, not really quite ready to attack this area yet. I'm getting a call from a number I don't know, who I don't think that area code is even close to where I live. But... Oh, the days of Ka'an. Very nice. Next year's harvest looks good. We will have to start thinking about manpower a little bit. Ah, uh, very good. So, right now, kind of hanging out. I really, really want those planes to be done. We have enable reform. Very nice. What else we got? New designs. Refitting pre-war craft and manufacturing. Simple seagoing craft has been enough to secure naval dominance for now, but we can't rely on those methods forever. We must create new innovative designs to ensure that we continue to rule the ways. So right now, since our line isn't moving very much, I'm going to call in Audible. So give me... Um, one, two, three. Give me those nine. You're coming back here. I'm going to try to bait the enemy to attacking me because why not exploit the AI if you can? Because why not? Oh, they actually... Decided to assault us here. Interesting. Very interesting. Interesting maneuver. I don't think that's going to do very well for you, though. Or it won't do very well for me. One of those. Oh, we need more guns. Oh, crap. Uh, yeah, definitely put you at the... Oh, you're already at the top. Um, demo teams are okay-ish. Fire, fire, we got plenty of fire team stuff, so... I don't feel bad about doing this. Do that. Incinerators, dynamite, and stuff like that. Uh, we're okay. I don't mind taking maybe off like three, perhaps. Not bad. Oh, and for this, you could definitely do that. Nice. Bone Dancers is gone, I guess. Not really of a big concern, but whatever. Help attack this way as well. You two help attack. Actually, if we can break these guys, we might be able to attack across the river immediately. That would be very nice. All right. We have not convinced the enemies to attack us just yet. Hmm. Puebla City would be good to get as well. Hold Puebla City, because we can get some supplies through there. As well as that port. That could prove to be very interesting. Hmm. Maybe instead of attacking there. Because then I have to attack this five division stack, which would be very difficult to do. Actually, that's not a bad idea. We can attack over here. We would have a, a port to supply ourselves. Which isn't bad. Um, yeah, give me some basic laser weaponry first of all, though. Let's see what we do around here first. And actually, you guys could probably do okay if you attack this way. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Get those spec ops in there. Oh, yeah. And immediately begin to attack as well. You might be able to break these guys. That would be good. And if anyone comes down south... Oh, look, we made it. Very nice. Give me one. I'm going to start spreading my soldiers out a little bit more so they the enemy begins to attack me and think that they might be able to beat me. Uh, there will be no beating here unless... I'm not going to make a joke about that. Never mind. I'm not going to make a joke like that right now. I don't want to get this video ever demonetized. Nice. Good. Very nice. We spread ourselves out just a little bit. Can't really make an encirclement, but using spec ops right now, it's not a bad idea to bait the enemy into wearing themselves down further against us. Alright, we seem to be winning. I mean, it isn't going super great. Just because doing this is a little crazy. But, you know, whatever. Um, they, really not, they really don't have a ton of divisions around here, which is fine and dandy. You guys, go and take off that 9 division there. Uh, oh, whoops. E daisy. You, 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 and then you, you. Come down there. Um, I don't really want you to attack over the river like that. That seems a little bit too wasteful. We'll see what happens. So, they're not really attacking anywhere else. Oh, wait, we can't navally invade up here, though. That's right. Dang it. Yeah, there's really no way for me to get to the other side to help navally invade that area, which really, really sucks. Hmm. Reliability's nice. It's not super, super important. More recon. I think we got good enough recon right now. Let's do a little bit more stim pack. You know, medical company stuff. Yes, we broke over the river. Thank God. That's good. Let them maybe bait bait them into attacking us, perhaps. Just because I have to keep an eye on our manpower. We don't get a lot of manpower, unfortunately. New designs, very nice. The Grand Gulf Fleet. Whilst the Itzen Fleet may rule the waves of southern the Gulf, 
We do not know much about the other naval powers of the continent to be able to confidently declare victory. Our fleet must be invincible. I am inevitable. Oh, man. Um, for a year, we get we lose some consumer goods, but we get more dockyard output. Yeah, let's save that for a little, a little bit. Promote Almirante Perez. Well, we can't, don't have to do that either just yet. Loyalty through love, a subject of strength. Man, we already finished up a ton of these focuses. I, I want I want more focuses to play with. Well, I'll do this. Needless to say, the Geros de Honduras knows how to handle their weaponry. As we integrate their lands and peoples, it has become clear that we that there are a great many veterans eager to serve a purpose in the fa face of our conquest. Though it may be a risk to simply integrate them into our army, we so see no reason why they cannot be a part of the industry which fuels our horde machine. Nice. Um, let's re let's redo this guy. U10. Honestly, it's probably too much right there. <clears throat> Excuse me. And then y the rest of y'all, eh, not you, come over here and do that. And already, give me half you guys come that way. Because I'm going to start snaking around here a little bit. That will be very good. God dang, who is actually moving this way? These three divisions. No, thank you. Polyalphabetic ciphers, nice. More research speed sounds pretty good. Yes, I do want to research more ship, ship stuff, but mm, can't do it quite yet. <clears throat> we definitely need more decryption. But honestly, I'm at this moment, I'm still waiting a little bit to uh, stop, offer a sacrifice. I want to have a good harvest. Uh, but I want to wait for a, the... Close air support planes. That's what I really want. That's what I really, 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 really want. Uh, maybe put a dockyard here. Ooh, actually, we need more military factories. Let's do that, too. 60%, 70%, 90%, 80%. Oh, my gosh. Beautiful. Oh, and they're attacking me like I knew they would. Now, this is dangerous because we lose this tile. That's not good. But we are wearing them down a little bit, which is nice. Very nice. My goal is just to wear them down as much as po Oh, they're attacking over here, too. Are they attacking anywhere else? No, no, no. Cool, cool, cool. Let's see, they have a lot of divisions, but they're taking seven times as many casualties as us. Beautiful. Alright, so they're attacking us. Pretty typical. Is there anywhere that I can exploit, perhaps? Maybe I can lower this by another one, perhaps, maybe? What if I try to attack here? It looks like this might be good to attack. Take our infantry, which is probably the best infantry, compared to my puppets, and we might be able to win there. Take back some of our land, perhaps. That would be great. Over here, our division has lost it, and that's fine. Go ahead and retreat down here. Totally fine. Uh, this division is going to be getting a lot of uh, XP by doing this, and they're attacking us all. That's a lot of divisions all around. But two divisions here, that's not bad. As long as we don't lose this tile, we'll be okay. Um, we need more supplies, though. Where is... Oh, the, oh God. That supply base is all the way over there. Um, yeah, put you at the top. I need to like, actually get some supplies through here. Uh, don't you dare attack. You don't need to attack. That's a little crazy. And as much as we love craziness, we don't really need to do that. Now can we attack here? This might not be go very well, but I'm going to try it anyways. See what happens. See if we can get anything. they got four divisions that are dug in fairly well. Um, we might be able to win. It will definitely cost us some manpower. Do that, but definitely do you first. Because I want to start putting in some planes around here. Porfir Porfirio Lo Lozada falls ill. Well, this is no time to fall ill, man. Throw in that extra vision. You can make your way down here to help cover that basis. Uh, they're not attacking us still. Subject of strength, very nice. Rapid prototyping, very good. Loyalty through love, no. My woman is going to stay single for now. Um, I really don't want to use that other dock, this focus, because that I want to save that for when we actually have a ton of dockyards. So let's do something here. I think we're, that's pretty much all the focus that we currently can, are able to do. So, <clears throat> we're not really producing any planes at the moment, so that'd be a waste. Resistance, construction repair, suppressed subjects, construction engineering. Mm, that's okay. It doesn't help us build factories any faster. Production. Suppressed subjects. Well, since we're using their divisions, we might as well start suppressing them. I might be able to use their factories... Anyways, soon enough, so... Oh, yeah, definitely get some more construction speed, too. <clears throat> Excuse me. Do I have Binky here? Oh, Binky's in here. 
My cat Binky has joined us. Beautiful. All right, so we were able to take this province. Very nice. Unfortunately, I built this area up quite a bit, so this might be a little bit of a struggle for us to take, but maybe not. Very good. Um, up north, obviously, I don't want to attack using our puppets' divisions because, well, they're not very good. Ooh, Andreas? Nothing. Typical Andreas. Typical. So at least we did take a little bit of our enemy's lands, which is always a very, very nice thing to do. Um, you guys, they're suffering from attrition. How about this? Give me one of you guys. Send you back this way. Definitely need a break in through here. I mean, there's really not much you can do here just because we're fighting in mountains and hills. And we have no air superiority, which really could really just turn the tide of the battle, or the, even the war. But man, I love coffee. Probably too much. Cool, we took that tile. Great, 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 great. Oh, actually, we launched the naval invasion. Go right ahead. We can take those guys out. They're pretty weak. Uh, what? Strength 14 combat width? Alright, that's not terrible. Go ahead and help them out. And we take the port, and then we might be able, with our spec ops, cut off these three tiles if we can actually attack well enough. Take Get some more infantry in there. We're going to need that. You, Tahun. Oh, we actually took that tile. So we'll take out two divisions, or two tiles, which would be nice. And we're getting attacked. It did cost us quite a bit of manpower. Probably close to three, two and a half thousand casualties. All right, not bad, not bad. Um, how's this looking down here? Always keep an eye on what's going on. Oh, that definitely helped. Removing that one division helped our supply by quite a bit. That's very nice. Spec Ops, Tahun is doing a great, great job. Oh, and if they're going to attack, I'm going to open up another tile front. Open up that combat with boys. They're getting shelled. I, w I would like to know how much damage they're taking from shore bombardment. I wonder if there's still a cap on how much bombardment you can do in a single battle. Because I think they used to cap it. It might still be capped, though. I'm not really sure. I uh, will have maybe have to expand this. Get more manpower eventually. Come on, guys. You got this. I know we need more guns, but we're doing better than we were before. Come on. They keep throwing in more and more divisions. Kind of annoying, but whatever. Give me one more division from here. <clears throat> Very nice. Tasty, tasty, tasty. All right, they're still not attacking anymore. Got a little water. We got better stim packs. Let's get even better stim packs now because we are going to suffer a lot of losses. Um, their infantry still has no support companies, which is fine. We got motorized flight. Let's get that triplane attacker, baby. Yes, yes, yes. Because right now, no one is air superiority. Or at least for everyone that we're fighting. So, And Kaiser is still slowly, maybe kicking some NCR booty. Maybe, maybe not. They kind of definitely slowed down, but they're still advancing. For us, we're doing a great job. Tahoon is doing all right. My goodness, this is taking forever to try to get this tile. It's an extremely important tile, though. I will say that. So, a lot of spec ops and some regular infantry divisions. All right. Come on. There's. I know we're attacking four divisions at a time, which is kind of nuts. Um, it only costs 28 for force attack. Not bad. They keep throwing in more divisions. Come on. You have to crush these guys fast before these guys can move in there. Come on. Yes, we did it. Now, immediately... Now, this isn't a ton of divisions that we can kill but immediately begin assaulting these places. And they didn't like that, and they're attacking us. Good. They should feel bad about that. Because when that is done, I will move my spec ops into here, and we might begin moving around here, maybe? Maybe not? Not really sure? Oh, we have ports down here. That's good. That's actually really, really good. Give me half of you guys move up here. Ooh, two pill. Yes, please. More attack. Thank you. Anyone else have upgrades? Ernesto? No. All right. Any, some of you guys know? All right, then. Nice. And I didn't see how many divisions we killed, but whatever. So, I don't think we really need these guys too much anymore, but you never know. So, go ahead, do this. You can guard the entire front line like that. Now, that's going to be nice. Make it a little bit more manageable. Now, we have an extra army that we can't probably move around. Spec Ops, how are you doing? Oh, I pushed you up there. Huh. Okay, then. Don't remember doing that, but okay. 
Uh, naval invasion. We can't, we can't really navally invade anywhere now. So, I will attack where we can. This division should just die pretty easily. That'll be good, that'll be good. We're getting closer and closer. Yeah, but at this point, there's no possibility of another naval invasion. That kind of sucks. So, we're going to do this, do this a hard way. Give me you top five. You're coming back down south. And just in case, I'm going to put a naval port right here. So we get maybe a little bit of supply, just in case. You never know. Awesome. Give me... Half of you come this way. And leave one division there for now. Because these... This 26 division is going to be a pain in the butt. But if I can use my spec ops to attack these 5, 4, 5, 6 divisions around here, that would be great. With spec ops, I think we can push that hard. Nice. If anything, spread yourself out. Maybe just one more tile that way. Very good. Very good. Is there anywhere else that we can masterfully attack? Maybe here? Um, you know what? Don't use my infantry. Use our garb... They're not exactly garbage, but our puppets stuff as well. Take that as well. You three attack this way. Hmm. Got a little water. Nice. Alright. I would like to take more land in this episode, but we'll see what happens. We will definitely see what happens. Uh, Nueva Aztlan, 17,000 losses. How much... How many divisions I got? Definitely less. They have at least 20 less than we saw last time, which is good. Come on, guys. Make it down there a little bit faster. Please, 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 please. Nice. We took that tile. Um, take everyone but to pill. No, no. But him. Attack that way. Take you guys. Attack that way. Take the puppets. Attack that way as well. Now we are starting to really come down a little bit more hard on the enemies. And that would be great. If I can destroy those 25 divisions, that would be so good. Oh, you're trying to throw in a Spec Ops division to help them out? I don't think that's going to help you too much. We got so much political power. This is almost too much. So I'm probably going to elevate our weekly stability because it only hurts our war support just by a little bit. Nice. Good job, guys. Good job. We have our Spec Ops pretty much all down here now. Go ahead and formulate the line to what we want. Get ready for planning. Make sure that these guys don't move. Because once those guys are dead, I'm going to do a general push from the south up. And west. Miniaturized circuitry. Very nice. Let's get a little bit more reinforce rate. How shall we? Oh, infantry guns are doing so much better. We need more demo forces, though. <clears throat> Gliders. Demo. Demo. Do I have demo stuff? You're the incinerator, right? Oh, I need anti-tank rifles, too. Incinerators come up top. Mmm... Do that. Cool. We can build more stuff. Uh, for now, actually, I think we can afford uh, maybe a civilian factory in some places. 60, 60, 70. Yeah, there you go. Because I want to have as many civilian factories as possible to build up our armies. Cool. Let's go ahead and do the a decisive blow to the enemy's lines here. Because if I can remove those divisions, that'll spell the end of Nueva Aztlan for the most part. Come on. Oh, yeah. Give you guys a push. Definitely push hard through this. You, they won't even know what hit them. They have no commander here. Oh, look at that. The red line. Yes. Yes. Oh, my goodness. We did it. We encircled... How many divisions is that? 21. 26. We actually got the 26 divisions. They don't like that. So, in return, we're going to attack him in the butt. And make sure that they can't move. Um, yeah. You make your way back here immediately. Just defend for your lives, guys. They're running out of supplies. We are not winning the battle by attacking them, but it's all for, it's all good. It's all good. It's all good in the neighborhood. Help attack as well. All right, we got some more divisions. Nice. Throw them on here. Oh, that is a mess. Who there was? I don't think there even was a commander, so you can't fire anybody for not doing this correctly. Oh, it's gonna be so bloody. Oh, we should have had human sacrifice for this instead of just killing them with a gun. Ooh, auto-injectors? I love being a druggie. Do that. Thank you very much. Uh-oh. Oh, the tide is turning. The tide is turning. Oh, no. Oh, maybe not. Oh, but that's beautiful. That's just beautiful. Next up. I believe we might be able to attack from maybe 
here with our divisions. Throw in our regular infantry too, because that our guys are pretty darn good. 20 combat width divisions, not bad, pretty good stuff. Right here will be a kind of a problem. So, let's crush them a little bit using everyone here, and then you guys will attack over the river as you're attacking me. Okay, move, you attack there. A few more divisions, very nice. And we're still winning the defense, that's good. This, a little bit of a problem. But really not really a problem at all. Grind them down a little bit so that they don't beat us over here so that they can move us out of here. I don't care about the casualties that we take attacking because the casualties they take defending are going to be enormous. Nice. Very nice. Very nice. Oh, even another division. Nice. He's a full 30 stack. Up in the north, they will never be able to penetrate us. These guys are getting kind of tired, a little bit tired. Oh, and they're dying. They've already lost more than half of all the divisions that were already over here. Holy crap, holy crap. Come on. They have only three divisions left, and now they are dead. They are dead. 23,000. They lost about 6,000 men right there. We've only suffered almost 3,000 in total. Jesus Christ, that was amazing. Now, Spec Ops. Oh, my gosh. That was beautiful. I know where we're going to do another exploit. Actually, before I do that, let's fix up this line. Um, I will do a general push, but I do want to take out a few more enemies first. You can come here. Spec Ops, you're going to leave the line here. You guys can move fairly quickly. We want to take that settlement first. Oops, there we go. Come up here, and we're going to draw a line to take that settlement. Or get close to it if we can't already take it. They have no forts. It is an urban area, so attack isn't super great already. They're pretty well strong there. So let's see if we can go ahead and attack using our best divisions. We might be able to win there, maybe. Ten divisions. These guys are pretty darn weak. Take all but two, and then you move up north, and take all but two, and then attack that way. That's all you need. Give it a little bit more push, and you'll be golden. Oh, crap. They actually cut us off there. Yeah, that's not going to fly. <laughs> They're definitely not going to win here, because we're pushing this direction, which will be good, and then we can push further south. Oh, you wanted to do a counterattack, I see. That's not going to work out very well for you, you see. Take all but, like, this one division. Andreas, do you have something? Oh, you're adaptable. Good for you. Push up north. I don't care what happens. I You have to continue distracting these guys. This is very annoying to fight. Ooh. Push, put some more divisions down here. We need to push through here faster. Come on, guys. You got this. Give them a little bit more attack. That'll be good. Yeah, I know we're not winning around here, but that's fine. Um, you guys, hang on. Hang on. Don't... Get yourselves all torn up, torn asunder. You guys pause for now. Just make sure they don't move. Up here, they're gonna they're gonna die. They're gonna fight to the death, they will say. Now as we beat those guys back, we took the settlement. Now attack from the other side, and we will have another encirclement. Even though I did build a port here, which wasn't a smart idea for me, but whatever. So they're kind of moving around. And we must take this province, so infantry. Six divisions against four. Let's see what happens. We have made another encirclement. Already beautiful. Go ahead and focus on surrounding these guys. With an emphasis on surrounding the bottom portion here. Oh, take that spec ops. They're going to need some extra help. Oh, we got some triplane attackers. Good, good, good. Let's get close air support range and ground attack. Begin immediately making some ground attack planes. That's going to be key to our uh, for our way to win here. Uh, do that. We got plenty of those guys for now. Oh, whoops. Whatever. We'll make a few planes. Just a few planes. Even though we don't exactly really, really need them a whole bunch. Kill the supply. Should not have built a port there, but whatever. Oh, that is not good. But we got an extra division coming up to help, so that's not bad. What? You, d you don't want to die there? Okay, I'll attack you in the butt then. You don't want to die there too? I'll attack you in the butt as well. Uh, for you guys... The last stand. You gotta hold. You gotta hold. You have to die down here, though. You definitely have to die. I don't care what it takes. Ooh, thank you. Dynamite and basic weaponry. Oh, they're starting to falter. They're starting to falter. Yeah, really shouldn't have built a port right here. Look at... 
all that political power. My goodness. Yeah, pretty good stability. Still suppressing my subjects, because they love suppression. Come on. Oh, they're, they're dying, they're dying. Come on. And we have got it. They're dead. Go ahead, I want to finish this war up as fast as possible. Or, faster now. Go ahead and just attack. End them. End them. Yeah, I know these guys are kind of tired, but whatever. Uh, push this way as well. Take this back ops. As well. Oh, they have an extra... No, they're just an organizer as well as a commando. An infantry leader. Level 6, not bad. Oh my goodness. Let's look at all those divisions that will soon be... Oh, destroyed. Hello there. Oh my goodness. I'll just go ahead and crush them. Nothing like a good crushing, right? Who needs attack in the north? Ah, and look at those divisions dead. Beautiful. Truly beautiful. Ah, uh, another nine divisions. Well, they're going to bite the dust. There you go. Oh, look at that beauty. Beautiful. Look at that front line. So, you guys rearrange yourselves. You have now have control of this entire front line. And now, I can actually put my army in different select spots to <clears throat> attack appropriately. Where do I put them, though? <clears throat> Supply probably isn't great up here. Mexico... Eh, it's not bad. <clears throat> I don't want too much supply issues, though. That's a real problem. If anything... We could attack this way and cut these guys off, maybe? Or I could attack this way and then cut them off this way. Yeah, I think these guys. Come down here. Uh, on second thought, come to the center, maybe. Supply is very, very bad. You guys, come on out. And be kind of a guarding force in the back. Because supplies, like I said, is terrible right now. Building up some more factories. I need definitely more infrastructure. Med X. I love drugs. Love drugs. <clears throat> hmm. Airplanes. Well, we need some fighters eventually. Not really super important. Spec Ops, Special op, Spec Ops mi Minimum Capacity and more Multiplier. Or we get more Hot and Cold Acclimatization Gain Factor. I like that. Nice. Let our guys move around a little bit. Get themselves situated. Get themselves organized. And stuff like that. But man, oh man. 27,000 men lost. How many divisions do they have now? 50. Oh. Oh. Oh, if you say 55. Oh, so... I know I will end the episode soon, but I want to get my soldiers situated first. I want them to have enough organization, and then we're going to try a general attack. Now, they will probably be able to repel quite a few attacks, but they won't be able to sustain my attacks, even though I need more infantry equipment and demo companies. Hmm, definitely need more of all this stuff. Definitely do that. Uh, definitely don't want to take that off. Uh, we're okay on support equipment for now. You guys do that for now as well. Getting more planes. That's nice. Uh, you guys are still moving around. Maybe increase this by a little bit. Not by a whole lot, but by a little bit. Um, I definitely want to try one attack before we're done here, though. Do we not have an airbase there yet? Because if we don't, that's totally okay. Oh, we have an airbase here somewhere. Airbase? Can we not use planes? I don't see an airbase. Huh. No air base. Interesting. Alright, you guys are done over there. I mean, there's really nothing you can do, so go ahead and train, I guess. You can always use more naval XP when I upgrade my ships. Alright, so it looks like our guys are poised to attack, and I want to do a general attack to see what happens first. Now, it's probably a terrible idea, since we're out of guns and stuff like that. But, I don't really care right now. Go ahead, and everyone, have fun with yourselves. Because Nueva Atlan really can't contain themselves anymore. They've lost at least half, if not more than half, of all their divisions. They're still good on manpower. And Makazuma just declared war on the remnants of Petro Chico Corps. Interesting. Also, if you didn't notice, they fixed the bug where Makazuma declared war on everyone as soon as Tlaloc, Tlaloc died. And it looks like Santa Ana's kicking some serious Republican ass. Holy crap. And Kaiser is still being pretty big. Pretty thick. Oh my goodness, we are pushing hard now. Uh, this... Yeah, I this video will probably go up to 40 minutes long just because we're kicking some Nueva booty. Ooh, 
That's some tough. That's some nice booty we're kicking. Mm. Gotta love that water after you're done with coffee. Alright, everyone. I know we're out of supplies. Especially you, Spec Ops, but... Kick it up a notch. Um, yeah, without you guys fighting, we our dependency on supplies definitely goes down. Oh, did I not give you an order? That's probably not good. Give you a few seconds for you to prepare. If they have more planning, they'll definitely do better, so... Give them about three seconds. Three, two, one. They got to 9%. Good enough. Go ahead. Cut them down. Losses. We'll probably maybe get up to 5,000 losses max. They've lost 28,000, 0.4, 28.4 thousand. With the attacks in the north, everything down here in the south isn't going to be super, super important. Go ahead and take this guy back out. I know I'm, this is probably a terrible way to do this, but attacking from with these guys, 30 divisions, divisions in the north... It's just super good. Especially if you start getting cut off Puebla City from everyone else. That'd be very nice. So much political power though, Jesus. I want to spend it on something, but I can't. A general's in abundance, very nice. Yeah, this is definitely killing our infantry equipment and support equipment and stuff like that, but that's okay. If we can win this war, that it'll all be worth it. Especially if we can cut these guys off. Oh my goodness. Come on. Side channel attack, very nice. 29,000, very good. Get some more encryption. We just got a little bit more decryption. That helps our attack and defense. I'm not sure exactly how it helps our attack and defense, but decryption and encryption are very, very key to what to warfare, basically. Ooh. Oh, we can't win there. That's okay. Nu Nueva Atzlan can't sustain these attacks. They're out of equipment. Now, we, we think, we know... We don't have a ton of equipment, but they're losing a lot of manpower. And they're losing a lot of divisions. Great stuff. Great, great stuff. Oh. Oh, boy. Heaven's Gate and Lone Tree was annexed by who? Iris is getting kind of big. Interesting. Oh, and the NCR is definitely dying. Definitely. Go they will go bye-bye. Oh, look at those divisions. Uh, you in the north. Help them out. Take out Puebla City. There's 14 divisions there. Take them all out. Yeah, this is definitely going to go to 40 minutes. Uh, where's our capital? <laughs> oh, baby. If we do that... Yeah. Seven divisions there. Two divisions. Yeah, make your way over there. That'd be good. Um, We'll end up so once we take Puebla City, probably. Go ahead and help attack it right there. Come on, guys. Eh, you keep helping it attack right there as well. How can you move out of there? That does not... How does... How did... What? I, I'm pretty sure you're getting attacked. Uh, more... Ooh, more organization. Thank you. Come on, take Puebla City. Come on. Oh, you guys are not doing very much. Throw you guys in there, even though that's a probably bad idea for supplies. Oh my goodness, look at our supply stuff. That's terrible. I just want Puebla City, and then we'll call it an episode. Oh, monoplane attackers. Yes, please. I hope I can use them. Come on. They, that division came back for some reason. Not sure why. 30,000 losses. Very nice. Their capital is... Oh, it's all... Oh, my gosh. It's all the way up there to Tepic. Holy cow. All right. Come on. Oh, they actually came back out. Oh, my goodness. This is taking forever. Just kill them all, guys. Come on. You're level six. Yeah, we're fighting through some forts, but that's not really good. But whatever. And they are gone. Now murder the whole bunch here. Come on, kill them off. And they have been destroyed. Come on, you got this? It's only one division? Nice, cool. That's where we're going to end the episode today. I know this episode went a little bit longer. And let's go ahead and stop these attacks because our supply isn't doing super, super good. But anyways, guys, thank you very much for watching. I told you we would push very heavily into Nueva Atzalan, and we did. So, with that in mind, thank you very much for uh, watching the video, guys. Leave a like if you liked the video. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link below and so, tell me hello on Discord. And I will see you tomorrow as we watch Santa Ana win the war probably against the Re Republic of the Rio Grande. W witness Kaisar kill off the NCR. And witness the death of Nueva Atlan and maybe even Petro Chico. Thank you very much for watching and I hope you all have a great, great day.